what's up you checking out the frequent flyer and i have something pretty cool to show you guys today this is the vifly beacon this is a wireless self-powered drone buzzer so you can use this for your phantom or any other gps drone or any drone for that matter that doesn't have its own buzzer as a lost model alarm and theft alarm so check it out this is what it comes with this is the beacon here it looks just like the Vifly Finder, but let's sit this off to the side. And so check it out. This is a little zip tie that they give us to fasten it onto something, maybe onto the leg of your drone or whatnot, maybe an arm. We have a patch of double-sided mounting tape here, in case you want to mount it that way. And we have a little instructions fold out here. So it has a micro USB port, a button, a LED light, a buzzer, and there's a LiPo battery, so it has its own battery. Operation is detailed here. How to activate it. You hold the button for two to five seconds to turn it off or on. When you turn it on, the buzzer will sound two whispers continuously, and LED is on shortly. When turning off, the buzzer will sound three whispers continuously. I think they mean beeps, but they're saying whispers. <laughs> So how to alarm. When detecting a big crash, the Vifly beacon will enter a pre-alarm status that it will sound one whistle every three seconds. If another movement is detected in 30 seconds, the pre-arm status will be released. If no movement is detected in 30 seconds, it will enter alarm status. The buzzer will beep two loud sounds continuously every 6 to 12 seconds. LED will flash when detecting the light darkness. So if you're in the dark, this thing will flash really bright and you should be able to find it that way as well. There's a still an alert. So there's a theft uh, mode on here. It says stilling alert function will be activated when Vifly beacon enter the alarm status. If detecting quick movement, it will beep continuously to warn the picker. <laughs> I guess that's the thief there. <laughs> Hold the button for two to five seconds to turn off the buzzer and release the warning status. So let's see if we can test this to get it to work. So we hold it a little while to get it to turn on. You saw that flash of light, so now it's on. It should be very low. There it is there. So let's toss it to simulate a crash maybe. So it's over here, just beeping. I guess it's in crash mode. I'm gonna let it sit here for a while, see if it starts the alarm loudly. So we got 30 seconds. There it is. Wow, and it's pretty loud. So there it is. It's alarming now. So let's see if somebody tried to steal this thing. <laughs> well, actually, let's see if we can simulate the, uh, the beacon thing that's supposed to light up. Let's see. There it is. So I'm covering it up so you can see a little light coming from it now. There. Okay, so let's try to simulate if someone was trying to steal this thing. So I'll be the picker. <laughs> I'm running with it. So that's, I guess, supposed to uh, make the picker afraid. If they can't stop, they wouldn't know what to do to stop it from buzzing like that, from beeping. And once they put it back down, it goes back into the regular alarm mode. There, and so, let's see. We deactivate it by holding this down.
and so there it is you charge it right here on this USB port and let's see how long let's see how long it says Now it says when the battery voltage is low the buzzer will beep two low sounds every one second charging via micro USB cable the LED light will be off when it is fully charged so when you plug this thing up via this USB port here the light will turn on and then when the light turns off that means it's charged up and let's see if it tells us how long the charge time is 1.5 hours so I guess that's everything you need to know there like I said pause it read it for yourself pretty awesome little buzzer here lost model alarm anti-theft device as well the Vi-Fly Beacon. Thanks for watching.